I think the IRGC is, is not quite the bogeyman that we think. Many of us may have had experiences with, as an example, the morality police, which is part of that whole securitization thing. And um, when you talk to them, some of them are just like, you know, man, I just got a job to do, leave me alone. <laughs> you know, tell your wife to put her, you know, damn headscarf up a little higher and leave me alone. You know, we see human rights as a, as a bigger issue, at least the diaspora does, and Americans who are interested see it as a bigger issue than most Iranians inside Iran. When you look at the population, even of young people, um, in jail, it's not, it's, it's not significant. It's not, um, you know, they haven't imprisoned 40,000 journalists. Um, like, how many does Turkey imprison? Uh, well, yeah. um, <laughs> not 40,000 journalists, but, but 40,000 40, people. 40, 40, Nobody in Iran, I think, thinks that they shot down a Ukrainian jet with Iranians on purpose. Clearly it was an accident. Clearly it's that so-called fog of war.